Welcome to Jerry's Bike Checks, where motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it. All right, guys, here's my campsite from last night. Pretty slick, pretty nice. Got a little bit of a barbed wire fence over there. Big open field right here. Take a quick look. Yep. I'm here in Sealy, Texas, uh, just outside of Houston, Texas. I'm in the first ring of Houston, Texas, so I'll be blasting right through Houston today, and then just camping right on the other side of it. I won't, I won't make it to Louisiana, and that's just going to be too far of a, including this major city. Here's my old hammock hang. All right, guys. Well, thanks for watching and stopping by my campsite. Appreciate it. Welcome to Jerry's Bike Checks, where motorized bikes are way of life. Let's get to it. All right, guys, so we're here filling up at the old Exxon in uh, Sealy, Texas, at this uh, Presque Hilly Smokehouse Exxon gas station, feed and seed, meat processing. Uh, they just do a whole bunch of everything. They got restaurants and gas stations, and who fucking knows what else inside there. We stayed over there, a good way, about a mile. This is the first, first of the gas stations in my direction, so I stopped here, checked over my ride. Let's feel the tires. Good, good. All right, so we're good to go this morning. All right, well. Welcome to Cherry's Bike Check. Motorized bikes are way of life. Let's get to it. All right, guys, well, we're going over the Brazos River. We've taken an alternate route around 10 because 10 was dangerous going over this river. Last time it was under construction and they're fucking crazy. And so, there, we made it over the Brazos River. Gotta get this thing going faster than five miles an hour. We're on Farm to Market Road, 1458. We're gonna be on it for like eight miles or something, it said. Got a little bit of a headwind right now. Keep putting my cigarette out. I hate these fucking fire safe cigarette tobacco. Fucking cunt motherfuckers. Pumping that poison into me. But my tobacco is, uh, it's at home. So I'm forced to smoke with all the goddamn fucking native smoke. Fucking savages. Motherfucking concrete truck. God damn. I wouldn't have expected that, but. Apparently, there's semi traffic on every fucking road in Texas. Had a really good night's sleep last night. Stayed behind a little packing and receiving building uh, at a patch of woods. Real nice, great hang. Look at all these tire cows. Heck yeah. So we just taking a break from chewing, just for a minute. Hey babies. Oh, hot possum. Oh, we're right next to goats and sheep. Old little old ugly sheep. Man. 
Stephen F. Austin Barnes. Yep, semi traffic is just a thing. Look how green everything got in Houston. Or outside of Houston. Holy moly, look at that field. Nothing but wildflowers. Look at it, it's massive. Look how flat it is. I wonder how many generations fucking toiled over that fucking dirt to get it fucking smooth like that. I bet it was more than just a fucking father and son. Look at that field of yellow. Come on guys, look at that. I don't know if the camera's picking, up, picking it up or not. Look at that. That's fucking amazing. Loving it. Fucking loving it. Yeah, that fucking little median is our shoulder. Just a little too small. Take my lane. Look, you see some serious patches of pink in the middle there. Look at that. Oh, that's neat. Wish I could get over there and get some photos of it, but I ain't that desperate. Look how tall that grass is. Golly. How many bees are out there? There must be a billion bees. I bet if I spent a few minutes looking around, I'd find a few hives, wild hives, lingering around here from where commercial hives done. Man, man, that's a lot of nectar right there. But good, this will be one of my better roads to road on here. Pretty quiet. doing it again today. So what we're looking to do is, uh, well, I better keep it close to my chest. What we're looking to do today is uh, make it through Houston, whatever it takes to get to the other side of Houston. I don't really care how many miles I get today, but as long as I end, wake up tomorrow on the other side of Houston. I'd love to wake up in Louisiana, but that's probably not a realistic idea. I think I'm 160 or 170 miles from Louisiana, but not today. Houston's so massive, and the bridges and all going across the rivers. So what I'm doing right now is I'm going north and uh, gonna skirt around the north side of the city and uh, end up on the bridge that I'm allowed to cross the, uh, the Sabine River on. Because you're not allowed to just cross any goddamn bridge you want. The I-10 Highway 90 fucking freeway goes through, uh, goes across the Sabine River. And I, I'm not, maybe I'm not allowed on it. I don't know either way. But I don't want to be on it. It's just too fucking sketchy. A fool in his life or soon parted. And that ain't Jared. What trees those are? I'm those pecan trees, pecan trees. Not sure. They look like pecan groves, but goddamn, those are big trees. Obviously, it ain't their time of year to sprout leaves. Yeah, it's got to be all pecan. I don't even see buds on them yet.
but it could just be some sort of oak that I don't know of. Mesquite, I mean, uh, hickory or something. I, I don't know. I really don't know. Looks like a hard wood, though. Look how long that branch is. It's longer than that tree is tall. Pecan Hill Kennel. Yep. M.O. Pecan Trees. I knew it. I was raised with pecan trees. Used to go out in the yard, get a whole bucket full of pecans, sit around, munch of pecans. More good looking happy cows there. Look at that eating grass on the other side of the fence. That's a smart cow right there. <laughs> Nibble in the yard. Pecan Hill. That's a good name for it. <laughs> that pond looks rough. <laughs> it had some sort of uh, hydrilla or something growing on it. Covered it up completely, every inch. This old rusty tractor. You know they put that out here so we could all see it. That's old John Deere. Good-looking fucking land out here, boys. These are million-dollar properties. Fertile soil. also loud enough that everybody can hear what I'm saying. I'll find out when I get home. Damn, that wind's starting to blow hard right here. Yeah, you turn a corner and next thing you know, you're in the wind. Ruining my video. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what we're hauling. It's the same truck. Road bed or some sort of construction material. Clay, dirt, you never know. Ground up road bed. I found to be a lot of these trucks are hauling ground up road bed. Which will be turned back into road bed somewhere else. Man, this is great asphalt. I hurt my ankle this morning on my right leg. I don't know what I did, but I can feel it every time I make a rotation. I guess later on I have to rub a little MAN on it and uh, make it go away. We're going about 15 miles an hour, 17 I think is what it said. Any 
fast or not, it was just too noisy to make, the, to make a video. Too much wind noise. I'm sorry I don't go really fast and tell y'all, you know, that I'm doing 55 or 75 or any fucking stupid shit like that. I'm fucking afraid to go over 25 on a bicycle. I've been over the fucking handlebars. I've hurt myself in ways y'all wouldn't fucking believe on motorized bikes. Broken fucking bones. Ones that remind me they're still there to this day. I've never been to a doctor. Yeah, I've been to a doctor a couple times. They closed up large wounds. And then I left and I never went back. Never been to a follow-up or had somebody remove stitches for me. I don't got no insurance or anything like that. We just pay cash. Hey, vultures! Getting a little sunshine. Warming up them bones. weather. Speed limit 55. Uh, but no word for what bridge it is, so who knows. Let's see if there's water down here. Come on, water. Come on, water. Oh, hell yeah. Every goddamn ditch and creek got water in it now. What it should be. What are all those mounds out there? Are those all ant mounds, fire ant mounds? I believe they are. Every last one of them is a goddamn fire ant mound. It's a goddamn fire ant fucking mega colony. Look at them. There's, there's a, several hundred, maybe a thousand, I don't know. Hundreds of them now. Oh, they're firing. In the south, ants bite. And when they bite, it hurts. Dang. For such a little, little tiny animal, you know. Ow. Alright, look at that beautiful meadow. Hey guys, thanks for watching and hanging out with me. These have been a really cool video to shoot for y'all and uh yeah, squirrel running! Run baby, run! Get it, get it, squirrel! Ha <laughs> ha! Look at that antebellum house. That's damn! Yeah. All right, thanks a lot.
So we're ripping up old bike trail in Houston, Texas. Hopefully it's gonna get me around the city most of the way. Yeah, really nice. Alright guys, well, thanks for enjoying a peaceful ride down the old bike trail with Jared. Thanks a lot. Welcome to Jared's Bike Check, the motorized bike trail way of life. Let's get to it. what it's like on this trail, a little bumpity bump, bumpity bump, 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 bump. I'm gonna have to do something about editing. Some of these videos will definitely need to be brought together and a lot of them are really big, I guess, I mean, 10 or 15 minutes long. Putting around with me. Continue on West Forty Third Street for six miles. Bike checks. We're motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it, guys. Alright, guys, we're on the other half of fucking Houston, Texas. We whooped that ass. We got the fuck out of there. I almost died two times. I think it was more scary than the goddamn fucking mountain roads. Mountains don't fucking move on you. There's fucking crazies in Houston, I mean, and it's so fucking massive. We're just on the outskirts now, going down Highway 90 East, headed for a campsite. Thanks for watching. Jerry's bike check. We're motorized bikes. We're way of life. All right, guys, let's get to it. So we just flew over the Trinity River, and we're rolling into Liberty, Texas.
They got ribeyes and oyster bars on the half shell, fried char grilled. Hell yeah. Fish, shrimp, gumbo, boudin, fietas. They got it all. Margaritas. Whoa! That was close. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Welcome to Jerry's Bike Checks, where motorized bikes are a way of life. Let's get to it. So we on a shadow ride. That's never a good sign. We just get getting late in the day. Got about 30 miles to go to get to my spot. Hope I can make it. This road's been about five, six, seven miles long that I've been on this old country road. Take me home to the place that I belong. Pensacola, Fort Walton Beach. Take me home. Lots of crawfish mounds. 